everyone, welcome to my channel. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about what laptop I used as a undergraduate computer engineering student. So let's get started. All right, so I know that there's a lot of people who say, oh, you should get this laptop or that laptop, or, you know, the MacBook Pro or Lenovo or HP or Dell, whatever. Um, and that the processors matter and you need to get like high resolution or you need to get touch screen or uh, you got to get a big laptop, but no, you have to actually get a small one because you need to put it in your backpack. So there's many different opinions and thoughts on, you know, which laptop is the best for my degree and what I plan to major in. And that is something that I wanted to touch on. I have had this struggle too when deciding uh, what laptop I wanted to get when I was a freshman or a sophomore in college. I had gone through, I think, about two laptops, but I just didn't know which ones to get because I thought there was, you know, this optimal laptop that you should have as a computer engineering student. So I did some research and I have looked over multiple laptops and I think the first laptop I had as a freshman was a, what was it? I think it was a Surface Pro, a Windows Surface Pro, Windows 10 Surface Pro. It was a very small laptop where you could have a, um, I, I'll put it right here. It was a small laptop that was, it was a touchpad and I think there was a pen that you could use and it was a, um, there was a detachable um, keypad. You know, I thought it was very handy. I used it for my notes, note taking. That was my goal is to just find something that will help me take notes and to go onto the internet and to have it light and small and very portable. So that's what I got and that was optimal for me at the time. However, that was at the time when I didn't know that I was going to be majoring in computer engineering. I was in STEM field major where I just um, was kind of exploring my options before I actually chose a definite, uh, a definite major. So yeah, that was the first semester, first year of college. And then the second year when I decided to major in computer engineering, I'm like, crap, I'm going to need a better computer than this little, little shit. Um, I need something that's going to be bigger and is sturdier and something that I'm going to be doing like programs on, running programs, so I need a lot more memory and I need a bigger keyboard and I'm with probably a keypad um, because I'm gonna be doing a lot of work on this thing. You know, so I looked around some more and honestly, I got lucky because the first laptop that I chose to buy stayed with me for the next three years and it was perfect, it was wonderful, I loved it. So specifically, this laptop is an IdeaPad Flex 41570 signature edition. Um, it has a Intel Core i7 processor. It's a very basic uh, computer, basically. <laughs> basically, it's, it's a very basic computer, um, but it's also very handy. So it's this guy right here, the Lenovo. Um, I had bought this, I think, 2016. I am able to, you know, open it and completely flip it around. And because of that, so I can just, you know, flip it around completely, it's also touchpad. So that's actually pretty neat. And there's that. It's very light. It's not too heavy. Um, I do like that you can do this. And I haven't really used this, you know, this flex very much, you know, the, the touchpad per se, because like I said, computer engineers, we don't, we don't need a touchpad but it's also nice to have. It's easier to just kind of navigate through the internet instead of having to use your mouse and drag the cursor to the exit of the window. I mean, you can just go and tap it on the screen. It's just a lot more convenient and just easier to use, easier to navigate. There hasn't been any bugs or anything. It hasn't been stalling on me or anything like that. It's been a very reliable laptop. So I would suggest getting that if you're planning on majoring in any sort of like engineering, it's not just computer engineers. If you're majoring in like electrical engineering, anything that involves um, the laptop a lot, I would I would get this computer because it's very efficient. I have liked it. I haven't had no problems with it. It's very light and it's big too. There's also a keypad. I have used that laptop and I'm going to continue using it until it dies on me because why fix what's not broken? Why go get another laptop when I'm perfectly fine with this one? So. Uh, yeah, there are other things like, I don't know, MacBook Air. I heard that that's a good one. I heard that's a really good laptop. Uh, MacBook Pro, I, I don't know much about the Apple computers. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like to see anything else like this, um, please let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Bye.